children of the atom. Men and women granted power beyond measure. Mankind, not understanding these gifts of evolution, have chosen to meet them with persecution and death. There are those mutants that agree with the humans that this world is too small for both species. And the one shall of necessity be forever stricken from the face of the earth. I believe in an alternative. A world wherein man and mutant coexist in peace. They're providing a much needed balance to an all too fragile world. To that end, I have assembled those men and women willing to fight for that peace to defend a world that fears and hates them. To that end, I, Professor Charles Xavier, assembled the X-Men. I will go to any lengths to destroy your kind. Your mutant gifts will be used to bring your kind to its knees. Forge has made a weapon like this in the past, has he not? He has. I was the first victim. No secrets were ever turned against us. Your extinction is now, mutant. Be careful, my children. And good luck. The first step began with the retrieval of the Bastion Unit, the prime unit sentinels that were behind the events known as Zero Tolerance were adrift after the defeat of their leader Bastion. The prime sentinels ability to morph into normal looking men and women allowed them to infiltrate the facility that Bastion was being held in and retrieve him. unit retrieved, it wasn't long before the Prime Sentinels returned to their primary function, the systematic eradication of all mutant life on Earth. Prior defeat at the hands of the X-Men no doubt dictated a radically different strategy from those employed in Zero Tolerance. Thus, very unusual alliances were formed. I will assume that your presence here indicates hates that we have an agreement. Let's get on with this. Just being in your presence disgusts me. These defensive positions are months old, which means they are worth next to nothing now. We're not so disgusting that you won't take our money, eh, Muty? So an arrangement was made. The exact details were unclear, but the one thing that was certain was that none of this would fare well for those of us bearing an X. However, if there is one thing that the X-Men can be counted on to handle, it is adversity. Ah! <laughs> 
Ha, 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 ha.